guys so a lot of new things today um i'm filming in my room as you can tell i haven't filmed a video in literally two weeks and i apologize because i had exams and i was studying a lot and then um now that summer vacation has started i've kind of been really really lazy so and my face looks really washed out right now i always feel like i have to say things in threes i'm totally a believer of threes um, but anyway, this is my main favorites video, and if you don't know what a favorites video is, it's a bunch of reviews in one, and I'm just going to talk about everything I've been loving for this month. So let's get into the video. Okay, so the first thing I have is the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, and it's in the shade 335. This foundation has a lot of coverage, and I really love it, and people say that this has, like, a little bit of a greasiness to it which I don't agree with um, it gives you a natural glow you definitely don't need to use a highlighter with this but um, if you're not if you have oily skin and you're not exactly into the whole having a bit of a glow look if you prefer completely matte this is not for you but I completely recommend this if you want to have coverage um, nice highlight and it's very affordable, so it's great. And the next thing I've been loving is this palette that I made myself. And basically what it is, is it's a CD case, as you can tell. And inside, I just put like um, some scrapbook paper inside. And I taped it down. And I sticked um, CoverGirl shadows to it. Now, these three in the center... Our blushes and then this is, was a palette and this was a palette so I just took three cover gold palettes and just made it into one thing so I have more space to store makeup and I've been using this blush right here on it a lot and I've also been using this blush a lot I'm actually wearing this color right now and here's the other blush so these two blushes are like the actual favorites as you can tell, the red is like super pigmented, and it has a bit of shimmer in it as well, but it's like a really bright red. And then this is like a really matte pink, which is kind of showing up as like purple gray. So, then my next favorite is this NYX palette, which, this NYX trio, that I hauled in my Ulta haul, and it is in the shade Rock and Roll, and it's got three colors here three colors so we have like a taupe then we have a brown then we have a dark gray and these are super pigmented and when I put these on my fingers they feel like soft I don't really know how to describe them but they're super pigmented so there's dark gray brown and taupe and I'm actually just wearing the taupe on my lids today so, yeah, I like to use this because it's a lot quicker than using my BH Cosmetics 88 palettes in the morning, and it's very quick. So, yeah. Um, the next product that I have is my Maybelline Eye Studio Gel Eyeliner, which I'm loving it. As you can tell, I've made a dent in it. Uh, eyeliner, which I'm loving it as you can tell I've made a dent in it um, I'm honestly gonna say that it's better than the Bobbi Brown um, pro long gel eyeliner or whatever it's called I'm not really sure right now but it's it lasts really long and this is in the color black is black so next pack I have is the covergirl lash blast in volume and this is in the shade Very Black. Okay, it's called Very Black. And let me just show you the brush. Why am I singing? Okay, so. So, if you look at the brush, it's got like a fat shape to it. And then it's got like these teeny tiny bristles that you can barely see. And this definitely gives me a lot of volume. I'm actually not wearing it today. Um, it's summer, so I wanted to go for more of a natural look because this is definitely something I would wear 
during the fall winter season and for a going out look but I wore this to school like the last like May so it's my many favorites okay so then for lip palettes I have two lipsticks and I then I wore these half and half of May so first I wore this which I actually used for my red lip tutorial and it's a nice red as I said in my lip tutorial it's like the nice perfect classic red so I'll swatch that much but I do and it's a nice hot pink I hold this in my Ulta hole as well so now next um, that's all my makeup um, I have a nail polish and I know I said that OPI nail polishes went on really streaky in um, my OPI nail polish review, but I really love this color. It's just a nice pink color and it's great for spring as well as summer. And this is in the shade Susie and the Lifeguard. So yeah, that's that. Then I have this brush I really love. Um, I use this brush to fill my eyebrows as well. I use it for um, eyeliner. It's an Eco Tools brush and it's just like an angled eyeliner brush. Yeah. And then the next product that I have is also a nail product. Um, this you cannot get in stores. You can either get it if your salon carries this or you can get it online at their store. And it's called Ipsica, Equita, I really don't know how to pronounce it, but it's spelled Q-T-I-C-A. And this is their Intense Cuticle Repair Formula, and it's just cuticle cream. And you just take the teeny tiniest dot, and you put it on your fingers, on your cuticles, and it makes, it makes them so moisturized, it's like out of your mind. And my last product is... A mint mask and it's just a CVS brand and basically what it does is it takes um, it gets rid of most of my oil around my nose and it also leaves your skin very smooth so I definitely suggest putting this on um, right after you wash your face so that when you put on your makeup it goes on very smooth and this combined with top primer it just makes your makeup go on so smooth and I always do this before I like go out or something and it just makes my makeup look super smooth. So that's all my favorites for this month. Um, wait, no it's not. Okay, so I want to say something. Um, it's not like beauty or at all. But I want to say that I, this month I've been obsessed with Harry Potter. And I've always been a Harry Potter fan. I've read the books, I've seen the movies and everything. But this month, um, ABC Family had, like, their little Harry Potter weekend when they just show all the Harry Potter movies. And I'm falling in love. And I reread the books. I've been rereading the books. And now, whenever I say something, like, it might accidentally come out in a British accent. Like, I'll, I'll just be, like, talking and I'll be, like, lucky good or something like that. And people look at me weird, and I don't know, when you're just around all that language, it can influence you, and sometimes things I think in my head come out in a British accent, and it's really weird. And another favorite I have is, um, oh yeah, I do have another beauty favorite, um, my EOS Evolution of Smooth Chapstick, I've been loving that, but I... I lost it. Like, I don't know where it is. It might be in a purse somewhere. I've looked all over, but I can't find it. But I'll find it. No worries. Okay. And then another favorite I have is animal crackers. I've been obsessed with animal crackers. Um, my friend had some in class, and I was like, I'm hungry. Can I have some? And she's like, sure. She gave them to me, and I ate them. And then by the time I got home, I was like, Mom, we have to go to the grocery store and get some animal crackers. And I bought like this huge jar, which I can't show to you guys because it's empty. I hate them all. I but I love animal crackers this month. Um, actually it's June. It's 
I'm also sorry that this favorites video is like really, really late. It's literally the middle of June. It's June 13th. Yeah, it's June 13th. Um, yeah, so, woo, this video is on 13 minutes so far, so I'm gonna go edit this. You guys have a wonderful day. Keep watching my videos, subscribe, and comment. Bye!